said it's your girl DJ. Girl DJ. I'm back with another video for you guys. Y'all see this unit here? Y'all see this? Let's get into this lace. Let's get into this scalp right here. Do y'all not see that? Y'all not see what I'm seeing, y'all. If y'all interested in seeing how I got this amazing, beautiful, flawless install, don't forget to stay tuned. And we're just gonna hop right in. Just don't forget to subscribe, turn your notifications on so you won't miss another upload from me, myself, and I. And yeah, let's just get into the video. Hey right, guys, so we are back with Elva Hair. I am super, super excited to share this unit with you guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick unboxing so you guys can see what all you get. You do get a wig cap. Um, they also send a card with, you know, more of that information on there. Um, so yeah, and also you get the star of the show, most, most importantly. And I do have the Brazilian Kinky Curly Hair. This is a full lace unit wig, y'all. It is 360 as you can see, so if you want to melt down in the back, you can do that as well. Um, be sure to check the description sections for any of the details that I missed. And y'all can see they came through in the clutch with the unit already pre-plumped or pre-plugged so like i'm sure you guys this is a full lace unit you can part anywhere on there it does come with four clips in totals and two drawstrings well not two drawstrings but you know drawstrings in the bag <laughs> so i'm showing you guys here that you can part the unit anywhere and when i say anywhere literally anywhere you can do a half up half down style you can do two pigtails that's why i love full lace units and i haven't had a full lace unit in a long time so i was super super excited to you know get my hands on get my little paws on this well, i don't have paws but you guys get my drift <laughs> so yeah um basically this is what i do when i'm not wearing the unit in the same day I actually went ahead and um, took the hairline back a little further. They already came pre-plugged, but y'all know I'm extra, so I just went in and plucked a little bit further back. But I also just, you know, prep it, and I just used water and my leave-in milk, like detangler milk, and that's what I do. This is the next morning, and she's fully dry. I don't, you know, she's fully dry, so I don't know what that piece of thing was back there. Probably something wet or something. But this is what it looks like before I do any authorizations to the unit no foundation or nothing on it and y'all this this these curls are so popping okay so um this is the hairline after i you know went in a little bit more off camera i did add foundation underneath the lace um and then i'm going to take this shade this is from the elf palette which i have listed below and i'm just going to put that on the top i feel like when i um use powder on the top and foundation underneath it really really helps my um installs look freaking flawless i'm trying to get it to blend as seamless as possible with my forehead now i'm just taking a pair of scissors and i'm gonna go ahead and create some jagged edges and i'm just gonna let you guys watch there's no precise or um you know like a perfect way to do this you just want to make sure your lines are not straight or blunt you want crooked crazy looking lines you can even mimic your hairline and cut along you know your natural hairline if you would like i normally don't do that but you can do that if you'd like Next, I'm going in with the original formula of just the original formula of got to be glue. I'm going to go ahead and secure the, the entire unit down. I'm just going to secure the front. I never secure the back because I feel like unless you're going to wear an opponent tail, you don't need to. And I can't see back there. So I'm just going to uh, secure down the front. And um, I'm using my blow dryer on a cool heating setting. For those of you that are new, got to be glue is not glue. I know the name. Is like got to be glue and that's why it is because it mimics glue but it's not an adhesive it's not a glue it's just a strong hairspray that can be removed with water or alcohol and I just normally use water to be honest so I'm gonna go ahead and secure it all the way around and like I said just wait till it's tacky use the teeth or the rat tail um, side of your comb to lay the front lace down and you're gonna do that on a, in its entirety
right so now that it's fully done I'm just gonna put my silk scarf on it and I like to call this a silk melt I feel like I don't know just adding hot heat with the silk scarf over it just melts it seamlessly into your forehead and it just looks so freaking good okay just gonna add wax on here so I'm gonna tangle it first detangle it first and then we're gonna go ahead and um, put our wax on wax stick on it and then we're gonna um, hot comb it now I am on a hunt for a good wax stick for you guys I have tried a few ones that I bought here online and I didn't like them so I haven't recommended them so I'm still using the wax sticks that come in you know different hair companies um, but yeah come with their wigs but i am on a hunt so don't think i'm just saying it y'all i'm really looking out for you guys i'm trying to find one that's really really good um for our units so i will also link this hot comb as well y'all this just does the dang thing i cannot i could never live without this hot comb um so now we're gonna go ahead and create a middle part um it be taking me a minute to create parts sometimes but on this day sis i really just got that part and i was like hey let's just roll with it um i'm gonna go ahead and add some concealer because i love for my um parts to pop it's gotta pop if you ain't putting concealer on your part then what is you doing you know <laughs> so i do that and then we're gonna go ahead and flatten it out just a little bit with our hot comb Alright, so now since everything is nice and neat and laid to the gods, we're going to go ahead and create our baby hairs. Y'all know I'm still working on my installs and, and not doing baby hairs, but y'all, I can't tell y'all how much and how amazed I was with this unit and its hairline. Look at this, y'all. It's melting. It's just melting right into my forehead. Like, what? Like, nobody can come for me today. I'm just sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm sorry but yeah with my scissors I just cut at an angle and I just swoop my baby hairs and then I just mix my foam wrap lotion with some got to be glue spray and I'm telling you it minimizes that hard look it doesn't just because the wraps in there um it just gives it a softer baby hair feeling you guys can see that you can see it for yourself since it looks like this is growing out of my head look at this like I was like no I can't believe this is this real right now? Like, I could put this in a ponytail right now and just be done. Like, this is how bomb the hair is. Look at this hairline. So, we're going to go ahead and just hang that once again. And we're going to put our scarf, our silk press back on and do another hot melt. And I'm not doing it, but putting the scarf on, adding the blow dryer on a hot, hot heating setting. And blow drying for like two to three minutes and then taking it off. And it's going to give us that flawless beat. I mean, melt. <laughs> But look at that, y'all. That looks so freaking pretty. Y'all can't tell me it don't. And y'all can't tell me it's not my head. Like. <laughs> Alright, so now I'm just going to go ahead and proceed by finishing this off install by doing my curly hair routine. Lately, I've just been using three um, products, which is water, a moisturizer, and a um, frizz serum. Uh, is it frizz serum? Yeah, frizz serum. And y'all. I will list that those products below too but y'all this is my favorite unit okay it was y'all i'm about to give y'all the whole review but y'all want to stay to the end to see that but okay y'all i'm done with this boy's over here the unit turns out y'all i'm i'm freaking obsessed okay this company right here they did the dang thing with this unit it is amazing amazing y'all okay so i'm just giving y'all a quick rundown of the entire process when i took it out of the package i didn't wash it condition or anything i just went straight into the unit and plucked the hairline just a little bit back because y'all know i like my hairline to lay flat 
I'm a little extra so you don't have to do it because the way they plugged it in general it was already flawless but if you just want to be a little extra like me you can go and do that after I did that I just added some water and a leave-in conditioner so overall with this process I did receive a minimum shedding and tangling with the detangling I realized after I cut into the lace that's when you know I started to get a few tangles here and there and that's where the most shedding came in when I cut off the lace of the unit after that everything was you know normal I had a few strands here and there and a few um tang well I didn't get any more tangles after I detangled it I'm just clear that up it was easy to do my curly hair routine y'all it was so easy I used three products my I think I've been saying the same products in the last three videos because my last three videos have been curly hair but um the water moisturizing the frizz taming serum and sis your curls will be popping i love the curl pattern on this unit i love the density on this unit y'all everything about this unit just screams that sis you can't come for me today because you can't tell me that this is not my hair okay so i love units that give me that vibe so if you guys are going for scalp vibes or units that are very very undetectable i would definitely advise you to check out this company um it's also a 360 unit we love is that you can part anywhere on the unit i showed you guys that in the beginning of the video um where you this is a unit where you can put it up and half up half down you can put two pigtails love units like that y'all so okay summertime ready y'all know we're ready to break loose this is definitely a must-have for the summertime um so yeah i hopefully i covered everything um also i love the density on this unit as well all information will be down in listed in the description section below i really hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know give me a thumbs up tell me what you thought about this unit and yeah i'm, I'm gonna go ahead and sign out see you guys in my next video bye guys